Well, hey guys, what's going on? Jamie here. Wanted to do a quick update for IX Global and the debt box. Lots of stuff happening over the last couple of days and really didn't have a chance to come in and make a, a quick video. So here it is, guys. Just want to give you a couple of things that's going on. Tons of uh, new, not really new, but that more validation to show you that this platform and this project is uh, legit, guys. Okay, I, I've said it before. I'll say it again. This is a project that you can get into and you know, be in it long term. It's not a get in, get out, you know, here today, gone tomorrow, pump and dump, meme coin. It's an actual project that's here for the long term. So for me, I'm uh, I'm mining, uh, you know, I have my nodes set up. I'm just accumulating right now while we're in a bear market. Because uh, once we get into a bull market at some point, we just don't know when, but at some point we will get into a bull market. I think those that are accumulating right now, are going to be in a good position. So again, no guarantees. I don't have a crystal ball or anything. I don't know what's going to happen in the future. So, you know, you know, take take it with a grain of salt. But that being said, let me go ahead and give you this update. I want to start, start off by saying that I am not a financial advisor. Never take anything I say as financial advice. If you're going to get into this or anything I talk about, uh, just know that there is risk involved. There's no such thing as a risk-free opportunity in crypto. So again, there are no, uh, you know, there, there's there's obviously risk involved. There are no guarantees. So please do your own research, do your own due diligence. And if you're going to get in, make sure you only put in risk capital, guys, okay? Because, you know, whether you're mining, whether you're getting into a smart contract, whether you're getting involved with NFTs or trading, just know that in this space, um, there is no such thing as a risk-free opportunity. So with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into this update. Again, follow me on Telegram, subscribe to the channel, all that good stuff. Let's start off by going over the January 2023 newsletter. Uh, lots of stuff happening. Um, and then I'll give you, you know, a, a much bigger update, at least in my eyes, a much bigger update um, as far as validation is concerned. So it says here, Debt Community, um, Happy New Year. We are starting the year with exciting news, new features, exciting new products. Um, it says here, we hear you to answer the... Uh, to answer the numerous questions that come in through multiple channels from the community, we, we will be scheduling monthly recorded AMAs. Please submit your questions about the ecosystem projects and more to the Q&A channel in our Discord. So again, not only do they have a Telegram, but they also have a Discord. If you want them to answer a specific question, uh, go ahead and jump into their Discord. Here's the link right here. You can go ahead and go into your back office. The link will be right here, and they'll cover it in their monthly recorded AMA. So again, not as if they weren't doing enough Zooms. They do like, I think there's a Zoom every day. There's always something going on. Um, but to add to that, they're going to be doing AMAs over on their Discord. So you can see that these guys are over-communicating. Okay, I don't know if there's such a thing as over-communicating, but these guys are doing their best to communicate with the field, which is great. You know, I'd rather have over-communication than no communication, right? Um, debt licenses for 2023 are officially sold out. Uh, debt licenses will not be will not be available again until January 2024. So, again, the debt licenses are completely sold out. Debt token has been doing phenomenal. Um, I don't know what the price is today, but last time I checked, it was at thirty seven dollars and change. You got to remember when debt token started out not too long ago, it was at one penny. So those that got in early on that, they did pretty well. NatG licenses are also officially sold out. NatG NFTs are expected to launch prior to the end of quarter two, 2023. More details and information will be available at that time. The value of all the, or excuse me, the value of the NFTs will be dictated by the market and may be different than the purchase price. So again, we don't know what the price of these things are going to be, uh, but just know that they are coming end of uh, quarter two, 2023. Rental licenses for the first time. Beginning February 1st, 2023, rental licenses will be available to the entire debt community. Uh, a limited number of licenses are acquired for the rental pool for each project, um, except debt. Debt licenses will not be will not be available for rent. When rented, these licenses will mine for a specific number of days. All rewards generated during that time will be placed in the renter's piggy bank, which is essentially your, your back office here with the debt box. When you have rewards in your piggy bank, by the way, you could withdraw them to your wallet. In other words, take your tokens from your dashboard, which is the piggy bank, and put it in your wallet, which is this tab right here. Okay, you actually have an, a wallet um, back here. That's why when you first set up your account, you actually were you you had to set up. You know, you had to um, you know, get the private keys if you remember that. 
So this is an actual wallet. Now, if you want to send it to an external wallet, you can also do that as well. Again, these are your tokens. You could do what you want with them, or you could sell them. It's, it's totally up to you. Um, it says here, for the time being, some of our projects will be removed from the rental pool until the debt council deems it time to reissue them as rentals. These projects include uh, Black Gold, no longer available, Nat G, uh, will not be available will not be available for rent after February 28th, 2023, and Grow uh, will not be available for rent after March 31st, 2023. License hosting. Each account is now responsible for hosting their, their licenses. We've covered that before. A couple of different options to host your your uh your mining licenses is debt hosting, uh, which is a V-Box, which is the virtual uh the V-Box virtual machine, or you can do individual hosting credits because when you have a V-Box. Each license can hold uh, or can host up to twenty licenses. However, if you only have like one license, it might be it might not be cost effective to do that. Or if you're just doing rental licenses, it may not be cost effective to do that. So um, again, if you have you know multiple licenses, it'll probably be worth it to get a V box. However, if you want to just do individual hosting credits, you can do that as well. I believe it's sixty dollars a year per license, if I'm not mistaken. Don't quote me on that though. Uh, but you again, you can do individual host credits, or you can do a micro box, um, which is a third party hosting service such as AWS, Vulture, or other service, um, or desktop box. Operate a single license of each project on a laptop, computer, or smart device. I'm not interested in option two or three. Seems like a lot of work and a lot of techie stuff. That's way over my head. I like to be, you know, set it and forget it. You guys know me. That's why for me, I opted in for a V box because I have a lot of licenses. Um, so again, figure out which option is best for you. More information about VBox and hosting is available at these links. So you can go here and you know check out these links. If your licenses are not hosted, you will receive an email from us daily alerting you. Please make sure your licenses are being hosted. <clears throat> account security, as you guys know, you got to be very secure with your accounts. Um, this just sounds like it's common sense. However, you know, common sense isn't so common sometimes. It says here, securities, do's and don'ts. Do save your mnemonic phrase in a safe place. Uh, do set a strong password. Do enable 2FA. Do log into your dashboard with one of these links. Again, always use one of these links because there's a lot of phishing sites out there. Um, but again, never give out your private keys. If somebody emails you, or if you get an email or a telegram, I mean, telegram is notorious for it, but if you're getting messages saying, hey, we're from the debt box or we're from ix global or we're such and such uh you know there's an issue with your account you know we'd love to help you fix it give us your private keys 99.9999999999 percent it's a scam so never give out your private keys or any type of security information okay um what else just here don't click uh, don't click to connect your wallet to any offers uh, don't attempt to log into your account using any other link than these provided above. Uh, things to know, looking for a record of all of your debt transactions, you can paste your debt wallet address into the search bar over at bscscan.com, and you can look at all of your transactions you've ever done with the debt box. Um, do not send debt project tokens directly to Binance. Use the internal swap feature available in the debt mobile app to swap your debt project tokens for BNB or USDT before you send the tokens to an external exchange. You can download the debt mobile app in the Google Play Store or Apple Store. Uh, again, lots of stuff there. So again, review that. I kind of went through it pretty quick. Review that. Um, but this is kind of what I wanted to get more into. This was the announcement the other day. Um, again, this is just more validation. You know, documentation beats conversation every day of the week, right? Uh, so again, the other day they mentioned debt ecosystem partners with RFEG to support the XPLR token project. Uh, debt ecosystem partners with RFEG. Key takeaways, debt enters a partnership with a satellite technology provider, RFEG. RFEG satellite-based XPLR technology allows for more effective and eco-friendly exploration and drilling of natural commodities. The XPLR token project will provide the advanced remote sensing and satellite imagery technology to natural resource developers across the world. And the Explore Token project supports digitalization of traditional commodity production, aiming to create tokenized value for companies engaged in the extraction and sales of raw materials. Uh, so again, there it's it's you can see how big this project is, okay? Uh, the decentralized eco-friendly blockchain technology, which is debt, 
Uh, their ecosystem has entered into a partnership with RFEG, which stands for Resonance Frequency Exploration Group. You know, do your research on them. Um, a satellite technology provided to support the further development of the Explore Token project and effective exploration and production of raw commodities. Um, again, this is this is huge. I actually posted a link to an article over on our Telegram. So again, go into our Telegram. You'll see the link over there. You can read all about it. Um, this is just some more information on RFEG. Uh, Shad Brandon, founder of RFEG, noted this important partnership will enable faster, more environmentally friendly subsurface mineral exploration across key public and private sector projects, starting with initiatives in Ghana, West Africa. Okay, and again, we kind of talked about this, you know, a while back with, um, you know, something that they, uh, re you know, the, the the video that they released. Um, so this is kind of like, I guess, the fruition of that, but it's pretty awesome stuff. Um, so again, you can read all about this. I'm not going to go ahead and read all this word for word. You can check this out for yourself, but it's pretty, you know, it's, it's pretty big. It's a pretty big deal. Uh, Link Gold, uh, DLG, um, agricultural commodities projects like Grow, uh, et cetera. The debt ecosystem is the platform that strives to unite debt project software license holders with the revolutionary potential of crypto assets combined with real world commodities. Okay. Um, so yeah, huge, huge stuff. Um, other thing I wanted to mention real quick, again, this is a, go into my telegram. There's a, a an article that I linked, um, but I also wanted to cover another quick thing. Let me jump into my telegram real quick. Sorry about that, guys. Give me one second. Let me find this, uh, this post. Uh, Okay, give me one second here. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to look for the actual article. You can actually check it for yourself in my Telegram. I'm trying to pull it up here, but it might be all the way up. Uh, let me see if I can find it here. If I can't, it's no big deal. Um, okay, here it is. So, uh, one second, guys. Sorry about that. Okay. So, it says here, um, for those who may be seeking further validation about our technology um, and a hint about a license you might want to get your hands on, um, Explore announces new partnership with Exo Exosphere Satellite Technologies from Fleet Space. Explore Token is a satellite-based natural resource-focused exploration technology. A lot of big words, right? Uh, RFEG. RFEG and Fleet Space have signed a new contract to provide Exosphere Satellite-based mineral explora exploration technology to, to enhance Explore's mapping capabilities. Um, Brad uh, Shad Brannon, as I mentioned before, he's the founder of uh, RFEG, he's also a debt council member. He said the addition of Exosphere 3D rendering of subsurface topography by Fleet Space propels the export technology product suite and technology stack to the next level by creating the most comprehensive satellite-based remote, remote sensing survey product available within the mineral exploration marketplace to date. All of that just to say, it's a big deal. <laughs> uh, so let's look. take a quick look at this article. Give me one second here. Uh, okay. Let me pull up that article real quick. Okay, so you can see the article right here. Again, I posted this in over in our Telegram a couple of days ago. That's why follow me on Telegram. You're, I'm not making a video about it now because I'm getting around to it, but I posted about this days ago. So if you want to get information, you know, up to date, like, you know, time sensitive, not that there's anything, you know, time sensitive about this because it's not like you're, you know, you got a race to find out about this before anyone else, but, you know, you'll get more information uh, as I as I get it. I'm over on our Telegram. So you can see all here. Pretty cool stuff. All right. Um, so the other thing I want to just mention real quick is another cool thing that provides more validation. And let me scroll down. 
another partnership, which is pretty awesome. Uh, again, more documentation for this project. I'm telling you, this is a real legit project. Let me scroll down here. Uh, here it is. So it says your debt announced a huge partnership this weekend. They will they will be partnering with MasterCard and Royal Bank of Scotland to streamline the onboarding fiat to crypto process. So they're going to have uh, an onboarding, a much more streamlined onboarding process, fiat to crypto. Um, if you're looking for further validation, MasterCard and Royal Bank of Scotland are two major, obviously everybody who knows who they are, definitely MasterCard, right? Again, I guess if you're not in Europe, maybe you might not know who Royal Bank of Scotland is, but definitely MasterCard. Um, and now debt can now say that they are quote unquote partners. So you can see here the card, you can get a digital card, plastic, metal, exclusive card. Uh, again, pretty awesome stuff. Again, just another notch in the belt, um, you know, that this is a, you know, a legit deal. Um, so anyway, that being said, this video has gone longer than I wanted, but you can see there's a lot of development going on, lots of stuff happening. Um, if you want to get started, click the link below. You, you have to create an account with IX Global. Once you create your account with IX Global, go to your back, your IX Global back office. You can purchase your license there. Once you purchase, purchase your license there, it'll automatically create an account for you with the debt box. And you can use the same credentials you created to log in for your IX account. And you can log into your uh, debt box account. Okay. Um, and they, that's the way you do it. That's the protocol. That way you connect your two accounts. If you don't do it that way, you're going to have a issue and, you know, don't just don't do it that way. Okay. Follow the process. So again, create your account with IX Global first and you're, you'll be good to go. Anyway, that being said, guys, um, just wanted to give you more information about this project, which I'm super bullish on. 2023 is going to be a big year. They have new projects that they're launching. They already announced two of them. One is a real estate um, a project that revolves around real estate. It's going to be a pretty awesome token. Um, and then there's another one, which for whatever reason slips my mind right now, but I know I talked about it in, in my, my, my last video, but again, they have two new projects that you can get in on right now. I think they have six or seven projects they're launching this year. Um, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. In any case, that being said, follow me on Telegram, subscribe to the channel. As always, do your own research, only put in what you can afford to lose, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.